What's going on everybody? This is the Mac Roberts back again with another NBA 2K21 My Player Builder video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the best Nate Robinson build. Nate Robinson was shorter than the average point guard at 5'9", but he made up for that with crazy athleticism. He won the slam dunk contest three times. He was also a really good three point shooter uh, or shooter in general. And he was solid in defense. I wouldn't say amazing, but he is known for having crazy chase down blocks and for blocking Shaq. He blocked Yao Ming. It's kind of weird at 5'9", just how well of a, a shot blocker he was. He would get those little sneak blocks just because of his height. But without further ado, let's get into the build. Position is going to be point guard. Handedness doesn't matter. Jersey number doesn't matter. I chose number four just because during his time with the Knicks, for the most part, he also wore number two. But in his prime with the Knicks, he wore number four. For the pie chart, you're going to choose the blue and green pie chart, the more blue than green. And that's going to allow you to finish in traffic. It's going to allow you to shoot really well. And you're going to be able to play some solid defense as well. For the physical pie chart, we're going to go with the speed and vert pie chart. That's going to allow you to be pretty quick. And because it's a smaller point guard, you're going to eventually end up with that 99 speed and acceleration. And that vertical at 99.9 .9 is going to be really great for helping him finish in contact. So for the physical attributes for your close shot, you're going to bring that up to an 87, max that out. You're going to max out your driving layup at a 91, and you're going to max out your driving dunk to an 80. That'll give you 16 finishing badges. For shooting, you're going to bring your mid-range shot up to an 81. You're going to bring your three-point shot up to a 78. You're not going to max it out. And for free throw, you're going to bring it up to an 86, and that's going to give you 16 shooting badges. For playmaking, you're going to max out your pass accuracy, you're going to max out your ball handling, and you're going to bring your post moves up to a 53. That'll give you 16 playmaking badges. Lastly, for defense and rebounding, you're going to max out your perimeter defense, you're going to max out your lateral quickness, you're going to bring your steal up to a 74. You're going to bring your block up to a 46. And you're going to bring your defensive rebounding up to a 52. And that'll get you two defense and rebounding badges. So 16 finishing, 16 shooting, 16 playmaking, and two defense and rebounding badges is a total of 50 badges. Body shape doesn't matter. Uh, he was actually really strong. We're going to go with the defined body shape. Height is going to be 5'9". Weight is going to be 180. That was Nate Robinson's height and weight, 5'9 and 180. Wingspan, you're going to max that out. So at 99.9 .9 overall, you're going to have a 93 close shot, a 96 driving layup, an 80 dunk, which is kind of low in my opinion. Uh, but unless you went with the all blue pie chart, you're not going to be able to get the contact dunks. And that's kind of a shame just the way that they set that up. Because, you know, a lot of people like Nate Robinson, and I would like to make a Nate Robinson build who could slash and get all the regular and contact dunks. But we have a way around that. His mid-range shot at 99.9 .9 overall is going to be an 82. Three-point shot is going to be a 79. His ball handling is going to be a 90, so you will be able to speed boost. Your perimeter defense is going to be solid in 83. Your steal is going to be pretty solid at 84. And you're going to be able to shot block with a 50 block. For your physicals at 99.9 .9 overall with the gym rat badge, you're going to have a 99 speed, a 99 acceleration, a 93 vertical, and a 60 strength. For the takeover, again, this is our way around it. Once you're in takeover mode, you're going to have contact dunks. Now, the funny thing about Nate Robinson is, yes, he was a great dunker. He won the slam dunk contest three times, but he wasn't a contact dunker. But with the slashing takeover, you're definitely going to get those contact dunks once you activate that. So the build is complete and you have ended up with a slasher, shades of Tim Hardaway, Chris Paul, and Kyle Lowry. Three guys who don't dunk at all. Now for the badges, for your finishing badges, you're going to put Acrobat on gold, Consistent Finisher on silver, Contact Finisher on gold, Giant Slayer on gold, Lob City Finisher on gold, and Put Back Boss on silver. Nate Robinson was actually really good at getting put back dunks. For shooting, you're going to bring Catch and Shoot to gold, Corner Specialist to Gold, Dead Eye to Gold, Flexible Release to Silver, Green Machine to Bronze, Range Extender to Silver, and Volume Shooter to Silver. 
For your playmaking badges, you're going to put ankle break on gold, dimer on gold, downhill on gold, handles for days to silver, uh, space creator to silver, tight handles to gold, and that's your playmaking badges. Lastly, for your defense and rebounding, you're going to put chase down artists on silver. All right, everyone, this has been the best Nate Robinson build. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you're kept up with everything we do on the channel. Also, you'll be joining the Penny Face Squad, and that'll help out the channel overall. So it'd be much appreciated if you hit that notification bell icon. Also, drop a comment down below to let me know what you thought of the build. And if you have any requests or you want to see a build get made, drop it down below and I will try to make that build for you. We've got builds coming every single day for current gen and when next gen drops for next gen. So you don't want to miss any of those builds. That's why you also want to hit that notification bell icon. Last and most importantly, thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.